For the 28th annual JCAST, we're so excited the fact that we are having more than a thousand artists who are participating across all of these art spaces. I tend to work with the minuscule. I've been doing exploration of invasive seed pods uh, that I've been using in multiples in prints and drawings in my work. This is the work that I've been doing for the last five years and it basically embodies uh, the souls of people, uh, sort of like in between worlds once they've passed and where they're going. Really excited, this is the first time um, that I've been showing this series because normally I actually do flowers. So it's just, it's, I get to be on the other side and I get to know what the artists feel like when they're actually um, representing their works. It's about three planets in alignment and part of the way I work is, is that I like to teach myself how to do things. So this is a representation of me learning how to make dodecahedrons out of wood. I'm just so excited about the way the art scene has grown in my own community, the opportunities that are here for me and for the other amazing artists that live here and call this city home. What we do essentially is pop art with a twist. So we try to figure out with different celebrities, pop culture icons that we've grown up with, been influenced by, to create what you see behind us. Uh, I'm Robinson Holloway. Normally I am chair of the board of the Jersey City Arts Council, but JCAST weekend, my main job is to be the curator and owner of Village West Gallery in downtown Jersey City. I myself am showing my personal collection from the last 20 years or so. I'm always making these little very precious things and they always end up little and precious like this and seem to get larger. Um, and you just, you follow the path. For some people it's going to strike them as something that's beautiful or something that's ugly and that's great. Any, any reaction to me is a good reaction if I'm getting people to think. Um, but I, would, I, would, I think the first part is really important, I think, to not overthink it. I mainly paint animals in this uh, deconstructed collage style. Uh, and my concept is that I'm really interested in um, how the natural world is really disappearing from our culture. It has no um, relevance or context really in our everyday lives anymore. I've been going to bookstores that are closing and I'm trying to um, take the book, let's say damage it, this one. There's a certain beauty of damaged books I found as a conservator, and you feel such empathy for the item in terms of what it endured. To me, I have only one frustration with Jcast, and that's that I can't see everything. And that is the one frustration. I wish I had a week just on my own to run around and see everything, but I've been enjoying everybody's Instagram feeds and it looks like a phenomenal uh, group of artists this year and group of venues and it just gets better every year. Get into it, it's there because life is there to be experienced, not to be frightened of. You gotta you got be there, you gotta be in your life and having your life and loving your life.